We face threats every day. Germs are everywhere, but our bodies are amazing. They have a secret weapon, the immune system. This powerful system is always working to keep us healthy. It's like an internal army fighting off invaders 24-7. Without it, we'd be vulnerable to every virus and bacteria we encounter. Imagine your body as a fortress. Your immune system is like the guards and defenses that protect it. This system is made up of a network of cells, tissues and organs. They all work together to keep invaders out. These invaders can be bacteria, viruses, fungi and parasites. Even our own cells can turn against us, like in the case of cancer. The immune system's job is to recognize these threats. It then neutralizes or destroys them. This complex process involves multiple steps. The immune system first identifies the invader. Then it launches a targeted attack to eliminate it. Amazingly, the immune system also remembers past threats. This allows for a faster and more effective response if encountered again. Now, let's meet the key players in this intricate defense system. The immune system is a complex network of cells, tissues, and organs that work together to defend the body against harmful invaders. White blood cells are the soldiers of the immune system. They are constantly on the lookout for pathogens like bacteria, viruses, and other foreign substances. They patrol the bloodstream and tissues, searching for invaders. When they detect a threat, they quickly respond to neutralize it. There are different types of white blood cells, each with specific roles. For example, neutrophils are the first responders, while lymphocytes are crucial for long-term immunity. Some engulf and destroy pathogens, while others produce antibodies. Macrophages are known for their ability to devour invaders, and B cells are responsible for antibody production. These antibodies act like guided missiles, targeting specific invaders they bind to pathogens, marking them for destruction by other immune cells. The lymphatic system is like a network of highways and checkpoints. It plays a crucial role in transporting immune cells and filtering out harmful substances. It allows immune cells to travel throughout the body and congregate in strategic locations. This ensures a rapid and efficient immune response. Lymph nodes, small bean-shaped organs, act as filters, trapping pathogens and presenting them to immune cells for destruction. They are essential for maintaining a healthy immune system. Other important organs include the bone marrow, where immune cells are produced. The bone marrow is the birthplace of all blood cells, including those vital for immunity. The thymus, where T cells mature, is another key player. T cells are essential for identifying and destroying infected cells. And the spleen, which filters blood and stores immune cells, acts as a reservoir, ensuring that the body is always ready to fight off infections. The immune response recognizing, attacking and remembering threats. In this section we will explore how the immune system identifies, combats and retains information about pathogens. When a pathogen enters the body, the immune system jumps into action. This is a crucial defense mechanism that protects us from infections and diseases. This process is called the immune response. It starts with recognition, where the immune system identifies the invader. The immune system identifies molecules on the surface of the pathogen called antigens. These antigens are unique to each pathogen. These antigens act like flags, signaling that the invader doesn't belong. This recognition is the first step in mounting an effective defense. Once the threat is identified, the immune system launches a multi-pronged attack. This involves various types of immune cells working together. White blood cells like macrophages and neutrophils engulf and destroy pathogens. They are the first line of defense in this complex process. Other white blood cells, called lymphocytes, produce antibodies that target specific antigens. These antibodies are crucial for neutralizing the threat. These antibodies can neutralize the pathogen or mark it for destruction by other immune cells. This ensures that the pathogen is effectively eliminated. After the initial attack, the immune system remembers the encounter. This memory is stored in specialized cells. This immune memory allows for a faster and more effective response if the same pathogen is encountered again. This is why vaccinations are so effective. They train the immune system to recognize and respond to specific pathogens. Boosting your defense's lifestyle choices for a strong immune system. Just like any defense system, the immune system needs support to function optimally. It acts as our body's natural defense against harmful invaders like bacteria and viruses. 
Fortunately, there are many things we can do to boost our defenses and keep our immune system strong. Simple lifestyle changes can make a big difference. One of the most important is maintaining a healthy diet. What we eat directly impacts our immune health. Focus on consuming plenty of fruits which are rich in vitamins and antioxidants, vegetables, whole grains and lean protein. These foods are packed with essential nutrients. These foods provide essential nutrients that support immune cell function. Vitamins like A, C and E along with minerals like zinc and selenium are particularly important. Regular exercise is another key factor in immune health. Physical activity helps to keep the body strong and resilient. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise most days of the week. Activities like walking, jogging or yoga can be very beneficial. Exercise helps improve circulation, allowing immune cells to travel more efficiently throughout the body. This enhanced circulation supports overall immune function. Getting enough sleep is crucial for immune function. Lack of sleep can weaken the immune system. During sleep, the body repairs and regenerates tissues, including those involved in immune response. This process is vital for maintaining a strong immune system. Aim for seven to eight hours of quality sleep each night. Creating a restful environment can help improve sleep quality. Section six, vaccinations, training your immune system for specific threats. Vaccinations are one of the most effective ways to protect ourselves and our communities from infectious diseases. Vaccines work by introducing a weakened or inactive form of a pathogen to the body. This exposure triggers an immune response, leading to the production of antibodies and memory cells specific to that pathogen. By training the immune system in this way, vaccines prepare the body to fight off the actual disease if encountered in the future. Vaccines have been instrumental in eradicating or significantly reducing the incidence of many deadly diseases such as smallpox, polio and measles. Getting vaccinated not only protects individuals but also helps to create herd immunity, protecting those who are unable to get vaccinated due to medical reasons.